Hello, I'm Dan Cherry, and back in 1977 and 78, I had the great honor and privilege to be the commander and leader of the Air Force Thunderbirds. This model I'm holding today is a model of the Northrop T-38 Talon. In 1975, our country was going through a serious fuel shortage, and the decision was made at the Department of Defense to equip the, both the Thunderbirds and the Blue Angels with more fuel-efficient airplanes. At that point in time, the T-38 was adopted by the Air Force Thunderbirds, and it flew with the Thunderbirds from 1975 to 1982. The airplane is exactly like, uh, except for the paint schemes and the smoke system on it, exactly like the airplanes flown by all Air Force uh, pilots when they go through their pilot training. It's a supersonic two-place jet trainer, and the Thunderbirds turned it into an amazing air show machine to convert the training maneuvers uh, that the T-38 was typically flying into something more akin to a uh, aerobatic performance. We were doing things with this little airplane that it was probably never meant to do, but we did it very professionally and carefully and safely. The model that I'm holding was presented to all of the Thunderbird pilots as they honorably completed their time on the team and, uh, and uh, went from their Thunderbird assignment to their follow-on assignment. Typically, Thunderbird pilots only serve two years, and so as you leave the team, it's pretty emotional. Uh, you, get, you become very close like family with your teammates, and so as a token, of your performance while you are on the team, a model like this is presented to each of the pilots. And uh, this is particularly my model, and it's really old, <laughs> but uh, again, I'm very, very proud of it, and it's very much a treasure to me. We look forward to opening the doors on the exhibit on March 30th at 10 a.m where you'll be able to see for yourself all of these amazing Thunderbird artifacts.